This is Cloud the Jedi here for another Star Wars action figure review. Today we'll be reviewing a Star Wars Vintage Collection Return of the Jedi Emperor's Royal Guard. This particular action figure has been very difficult to get. It's part of that last wave line of uh, the Vintage Collection which was only released through uh, online as far as I know. It's a uh, VC-105. And anyway, it's a pretty, definitely a tough one to find here in the States. Um, your only choice is basically getting it off of eBay. Um, if you had been lucky enough to order them online way back when, around the summertime when they first came out, you might have been able to get them at retail price, price which was about $12.99 over here. At least in most places I've seen right now, they're going for, well, definitely at least twice that much, if not a little bit higher. Um, around $30 if you really want to get one. Um, I got one online bundled with two other figures for 38 bucks free shipping. I already had the two other figures, but I figured um, 38 bucks was a pretty reason. I don't know if I'd say reasonable, but definitely worth it if it included this particular figure and how hard it is to actually find them at this point. So let's take a closer look at the action figure itself. It's Star Wars Vintage Collection 105, Emperor's Royal Guard. He got an image of the Royal Guard from, I want to say, one of, well, I guess Return of the Jedi, the Death Star hangar. Probably as the Emperor is about to uh, leave his Imperial shuttle. He comes with lots of goodies, uh, so much so that I'm going to have to read them off to, to you from a little piece of paper I got here. Let's see. Um, it includes a removable helmet, alternate helmet, removable outer robe, outer robe vibro, vibro active force pike, removable shoulder arm, armor, double bladed vibro staff, and holdout blaster pistol. So definitely. Um, the helmet comes off and you do have a face in there. Um, from what I've seen online, it, there does have a, a actual head of a figure, which is something I wasn't expecting, which is definitely really cool. I didn't realize that until I did a little bit of a research. Okay, you can see the pistol there. Um, You've got this long staff, the shorter one. One of them must be the vibro staff. Taking a look at the back, it's VC-105. You've got the usual paragraph that's in the back of most of these. Got some other action figures in this wave. As well as some vehicles. This came out, well, this uh, past year in 2012. Um, I know it was available online on realtors around June and from what I've read about it it pretty much was uh, one of these per case which made it even more rare and uh, it's gonna be a tough call not sure if I should open it up or not I'm really tempted to open it up and take take a look at them especially since it's supposed to have a actual head underneath there but we'll have to decide. Thanks for watching. This was the Closet Jedi with VC Emperor's Royal Guard number 105. Thanks again.